I know Chiggs is in here recording this. No Chiggs moved in here, right? So whatever you oh, say. Sorry, you know Chiggs gonna have, have everything up there. Whatever you say, Chiggs gonna be on YouTube with it, man. Oh man, we starting off 2024 with the utmost disrespect. We already had a lot of shit happen in the last week and a half. Come on, Cam. This is exactly why people call Cam petty. He does not forget any petty shit that you do or say to him, and he'll make sure you never forget it either. If anybody out there was wondering, is Cam over the beef with Melissa Ford, and is he gonna come into the new year 2024 with brand new fresh energy, ready to drop the back and forth between him and Melissa Ford? Well, no, Cam is still cam so last night jermaine dupree posted this video of him he was up at the it is what it is podcast studios he posted this promo clip of cam and you guys can tell me what you see on cam's pants pause here's a video here yeah, stat him yeah that man cool to love him JD, so so duff, man. Watch your fucking mouth, nigga. Big OG shit in the building today. Big OG shit in the building today. Salute, nigga. Now, as soon as he posted this, T.I.'s wife Tiny was actually one of the first person in comments to notice the pants. She said, Say, big bro, what the fuck is on your pants? And then that's when fans started to put it together. Wait a minute. That right there looks like Melissa Ford. And if you go to Melissa Ford's IG page, you can see the same exact picture that's on his pants on her page with her mouth wide open on his crotch area you guys can put two and two together on what the symbolism of that means but in case you're wondering it's all disrespect on cam side still just think about the amount of time and effort it takes to hit up a designer find a specific picture and tell him yo this picture of her I want it right on my crotch. Make sure you position it well. This is definitely 50 cent petty level. Somebody posted in the comments saying, this nigga Cam Pants, LOL. Where you get them shits from, bro? Cam responded saying it's a one of one. So now that we know Cam is not planning on stopping this year with Melissa Ford, what exactly do you do if you're M4? Do you just ignore it and let all disrespect continue? Melissa Ford is not the one to be confrontational with people. And I don't think Joe and the guys want to engage in another back and forth with Cam. Especially after Joe said he wasn't going to beef with anyone in 2024. I think at this point, Cam is fully committed to being petty towards Mel. You just gotta let him rock until he becomes bored or finds a new victim. And yes, if anybody is wondering, all this stemmed from Melissa Ford insinuating that there might have been underage girls at the whorehouse that they went to. And I know there's gonna be some people calling this corny. I personally think that right now, Cam is definitely going overboard. When she made those statements about their story, Mace was also included in it. And so far, we have not seen Mace get to this level. Man, oh man, are things heating up in this podcasting streets. Tell me what you guys think about this, man. Is Cam going overboard? Is this corny to you guys or is Cam doing exactly what somebody that was put in that position would do? Push comments below. Subscribe to my channel and like this video. I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, shop with my boy Chick Smooth at chicksmooth.shop.